All right, all right. What's going on, everyone? Aaron here, Clean Cuts Lawn Care. It is Wednesday morning, and we are on our 16-stop route. Every other week, it's 16. Other than that, it's 15, because this is our only bi-weekly that we have. And we got Robbie back. Yes, sir. We're back again. Back again. Good weather. This is the 30-inch that uh, the transmission cable broke on. I fixed it this morning. I did a separate video. Uh, got the adjustments done on it, so... It's back in action. It took me about 20 minutes um, to fix it. And then this cable is what went last year. Blade ignition, or the, um, yeah, the blade ignition cable. So, it should be running good. What did you do on your days off? I had a day off, yes. Oh, that's right. You worked yeah, Saturday. Still working. Yep, not till Saturday, so. Not, not till a lot. That's for sure. You go I to the... some of the Sopranos. Did you? Yeah, I, I, I got through episode five. I want to say. You like yeah. it? Oh hell yeah! Is it? It's oh, like yeah. it's supposed to be the best show it's ever a made. Bad show. Yeah. Sure. Good. Tony. Tony. <laughs> <laughs> All right, our first lawn that we're skipping for the year. And the back is just as short. We haven't had any rain for two weeks. Yeah, and at least. They're, they're not expecting yeah. any for two weeks. And it's been pretty hot, warming up, at, you know, it's gradually. Like yep, and uh, it's gonna cool down, but they're, they're saying no rain for a couple of weeks. So I already told Robbie this might affect us next week. Yep. Um, yeah, it ain't looking too. Not looking too good. Well, the weather's looking good, but. Well, yeah, but no not, rain. not good yeah, for us. Not for the growth. So I might have to line up a few jobs, uh, get some trim jobs together for next week, whatever we can do, um, which of course is billing week. So nice slap in the face, <laughs> but it's all part of the game.
comments told me that the Aryans does not play strikes. appreciate you guys watching our video but we'd appreciate it even more if you would take a second go like the video subscribe to the channel and then we'll get back to the video go ahead i'll wait baby come on they want to get back to the video no what's it gonna take five seconds just go like the video hit subscribe you can get back to the video this is this is ridiculous baby settle down no i can see him he's not doing it come on So 
I was cutting this yard here. I uh, didn't really have to do any trimming here just because nothing's really growing. Um, once I engaged the blades on the mower, I heard this very fine sound and uh, I knew right away the uh, blade engagement belt had cracked and sure enough, it's cracked. So gonna have to replace that. Um, that's what I mean about the Time Masters. They're great mowers. Uh, they're gonna give you a quality cut. They're 30 inches, so that's a plus, but be ready to repair them. It, it's just what it is. All right, we're back at the shop. We're gonna replace um, the blade engagement belt. Robbie's gonna be doing his first repair. Cause like I told him, once you have your own route, your own truck, your own setup, um, see Robbie's not a normal, typical employee. This is what he wants to do. He wants to be a part of the company. He wants to have a part of the company and eventually we wanna just have him running it. So it's not like, okay, go home. I'm gonna repair the equipment. No, he needs to know how to do it because once he has his own setup, I'm not gonna be doing it for him. So we're gonna have him do this. All right, so we got our broken belt right here. Cracked. As you can see, Almost cracked. Right. It was about 90% of the way through. So that's no good. What Robbie's holding there is the drive belt, which you pretty much got to take off to get the old belt out. All you want to do is take off the transmission spring from here. You move this forward so that you can bend the transmission a little bit, take the belt off the back, and then you can take your um, ignition, blade uh, ignition belt out. So let's get the new one put back on and then we'll put that back on. Here's the new one right here. Now you see um, how it's different on one side than the other? Yeah. One side is like curved. Yep. Okay, that's the part, smooth. the other side's smooth. That goes onto the pulleys. Onto it, okay. Yeah, so let's start in the front and work our way to the back. All right, so we got the first belt on. Robbie's about to put that uh, belt cover on right there. These two, right? The two smaller bolts, yeah. You can use that one for this one and then the smaller um the smaller one for the other side. So we got that going. And then we just have to get the um the drive belt put back on, test it out, and we're good. Man, I'm tight. Boom. Okay. So that makes a lot snug more sense. and a quick turn. Good. Good. Okay. All right, let's get this drive belt back on. Same thing with the drive belt. You yep. see the difference? Two different Now, sides. before we put anything back on, inspect it. it. I don't see no cracks nowhere. Everything looks good. And this is the original drive belt, too. Hmm. So, see something up here. Look at this. Oh, shit. <sighs> All right, all the belts are in place. Robbie put them all back in. I just observed, made sure everything went through the um, correct side of the guides. Everything is. Dry belts back in place. Springs are back. Transmission's back. Plates back. Let's check it out. All right, we're both getting out of here for the day. Um, like I said, the 30 got two different repairs today. Got a transmission cable drive cable and it got a blade engagement belt all on the same day but you know like i don't get mad about stuff like that because now i know it's done and we're gonna have a good amount of time uh before we can that issue is gonna happen again you know um vicky already placed the order for our extra belt like i said it just sits in the shop and it covered until it goes um someone asked me before why don't i keep them on me in the field i rather come back to the shop i'm never that far away that is a problem rather than having those belts sit somewhere in the truck or in the toolbox getting you know damaged or cut up or you know moving around i ra no matter what i rather just get back here and do it so all right guys if you like the video hit like subscribe to the channel leave a comment down below let me know everything i'm doing wrong and keep the meds clean boys i'm out